Our nation's Civil War ends in 1865. Two years later, Nebraska is the 37th state. As homesteaders stream into the region, forts are built to provide services and to protect settlers from native peoples. Fort Hartsif was established in 1874 in the North Loop River Valley. Named after a Civil War general, Fort Hartsif was one of the more desired stations of assignment. In part, this was due to its unique construction of limestone concrete, which kept the buildings warm in the winter and cool in the summer. Trees were scarce at the time, but the gravel was an ample supply. The rocky construction is why Fort Hartsif is one of the few forts to have withstood time with original sections still standing. Except for the Battle of the Blowout in which one Hartsif soldier was killed, there were few incidents with natives. Hartsif infantrymen generally helped guide folks to Deadwood, South Dakota, and assisted law enforcement in rounding up horse thieves, train robbers, and murderers. After seven years, growing communities provided their own security. Hartsif was abandoned to the Union Pacific Railroad, then to private ownership. In 1961, a landowner presented the site to the state for development into the historical park of today. Periodic living history reenactments helped bring this part of the Plains story back to life. And don't forget, great fishing and camping about 20 minutes away at the Calamus Reservoir. Fort Hartsif, a premier time capsule.